I came to the Jam Factory after studying at UniSA, doing a Bachelor of Visual Arts. And I came here because it was the best place for me to develop my skills technically. I've gained uh, an incredible understanding of glass as a material. I think that my work has come along in leaps and bounds. I think the professional workshops we do with visiting artists are amazing. They're an opportunity to work solidly for a week with somebody who comes in and shows us some skills that we haven't necessarily got in this building. They've been a really good thing. The program has allowed me to develop my work in a more experimental way. The time and access that I have to a glass studio is invaluable. I think my time here has changed my work. It's become a lot tighter and uh, a lot more resolved. After the associate program, I'll be having a decent holiday and then moving on to establishing myself as a professional glass blower. Um, prior to coming to Jam Factory, I completed a degree in jewellery. Um, I spent four years making my own work. I've gained a lot more confidence from being at Jam Factory, a lot more confidence in my own work and my designs. Um, also a lot more confidence to work at a larger scale. Last year I had the opportunity to do a workshop with Robert Foster from Think Design and that was a highlight of the year for me. I've learned how to weld, how to use a metal lathe, um, a lot more skills in designing. My time at Jam Factory has really influenced my work. Um, my designs are a lot more resolved than they were before I started. We're going to continue making, um, I'm making jewellery and a range of jewellery boxes. I had researched the jam factory uh, several years ago and uh, I was just waiting for the right opportunity. I was working in the interior design industry and I wanted to concentrate more on my ceramics. I've gained uh, a lot more experience and confidence in my ceramic practice. Uh, the highlight for me was uh, the ceramics conference that was held in Adelaide this year. Uh, it was an amazing experience with artists from all over the world coming to speak about ceramics. All the associates were involved with the uh, ceramic conference and a number of workshops were held here at the jam factory. The uh, specific advantage was actually working in a commercial environment and being able to uh, engage directly with the customers. When I leave at the jam factory, I'm going to have a sea change and move to the central coast of New South Wales and set up a small studio producing one-off pieces and tableware. I arrived to Australia four years ago, so I was living in Sydney before coming here to Adelaide. I found the jam factory. Um, I just decided to give it a go. And I found this beautiful, amazing place, which I couldn't find uh, nowhere else. My background is industrial design, but I really wanted to gain um, skills, making skills. So that's pretty much what uh, Jam Factory has done for me. It's a uh, Uraba light. Uh, the name is a specific region uh, in my country uh, where I got the inspiration from because it's inspired in, in the banana uh, shape and geometry and banana leaf. Uh, I designed it last year but I'm still making and designing like more products from that idea so I'm pretty proud of, of, uh, of that design. Thanks to the program now I have like a more realistic uh, way to design. Yeah in, in the past it was a lot of uh, uh, what could it be if but now I can take the material I can cut the material and definitely is more real now for me. Uh, if it is in Sydney, if it is in Colombia, in uh, my, uh, my country, I'm gonna, I, I really would like to keep making things. So designing and making things, that's something that Jam Factory left in my heart forever.